Good afternoon, Oliver here from Mansell McTaggart. We're here in Pulborough today, right in uh, Pulborough High Street, or just behind at the moment, and uh, here to see the property behind me, which is known as the Bell House. Um, it's actually a former pub, which was it is actually Grade Two listed, but it was converted in 2002, we think, um, to four really lovely luxury apartments. Um, it's an absolutely stunning location, beautiful building, um, you know, retaining a lot of its history and things, which is really, really lovely. Um, so really excited to show you this one today. So let's go and have a look around. So we're standing at the rear of the development at the moment. Um, just give you an understanding of where we are, take you out the uh, front in just a moment. But I thought I'd just show you, um, this leads into a private residential cul-de-sac. So behind the properties, just residential houses, small cul-de-sac, so nice, quiet location but the beauty of where we are we are just a stone's throw from the high street and the shops um, there's parking here for four cars as you can see and there's one allocated space each to each property a couple of things to mention before I show you around the front um, so it's great to listed property um, there is a lovely communal garden which I'll show you shortly um, there is an annual service charge of approximately £1,400, that's £1,400 per year, along with a ground rent of approximately £100 per year. Um, so here it is, so it's the old pub, the Bell House. As I mentioned, Grade 2 listed, lovely old building, really beautifully restored and looked after. So you've got this communal front garden here. And as you can see, we are right on the high street now. So we've got a petrol station pretty much next door. So handy, there's a little shop in there as well. Just beyond the brow of the hill, you are essentially on foot, five minutes away from what's called the second high street in Pulborough, where there's a further range of shops. You can also very shortly be at Pulborough train station, which is Again, just five minutes away, it takes you with links to London, London Bridge and London Victoria. So just through a small pedestrian gate here, we'll just point out there's two doors here. So there's four flats in the whole building. The door on the right hand side leads to one of the properties. So the door on the left hand side, there's only three people or three residents that will access uh, this door. So let's go in and have a look around. Okay, so let's just go into the main entrance hall. So this is the communal hall. So you've got letter boxes as you come in, which are all securely locked. And you've got this lovely old feature fire, which obviously would have been a big feature of the old pub. That's lovely as you come in. And then one more door, just takes you to a rear lobby. Again, so all really well looked after. This is the door which leads out to the rear communal garden, which I'll show you shortly. And then you've got stairs that take you up here, up to the first floor. So just a nice wide staircase actually. And so there's just two properties up here. So we're here to see number four, which is this door here. Looks like there's a useful storage cupboard there. Bits and bobs. As we swing round, you just see, really is a generous landing, but communal landing. And again, rear aspect just over the parking in the garden there. So in we go through this solid oak door into the entrance hall. So you can see the reminiscence of the old pub with the exposed beams. A really large entrance hall as you come in. So just show you. Got a meter cupboard there, useful for ironing board, vacuum cleaner, etc. Place to pop on shoes. So 
first room we come to on your left hand side really lovely double bedroom really nice light room this this has got the rear aspect and a fitted wardrobe so that just looks out into the cul-de-sac behind and just over the communal garden just extends round got more storage in the cupboard corner cupboard there imagine that's an air and cupboard master bedrooms just at the front so again it's a really lovely size really light room got very large double bed there more exposed beams from the old pub so door on the side this leads us into a nice ensuite shower room again complete with corner shower And again, there's plenty of storage. So you've got a fitted double cupboard and single cupboard there. So really lovely room. We then have the bathroom. So two bed, two bath. Again, it's really comfortable size this. Small window to the front. Everything you'd expect to see there. This Nice door, just leading off the hallway. This opens into this fantastic room. Now, this is very large indeed. So rare that you'll see an apartment of this size. So you've got a full size dining room suite here, two bay windows to the side, over to the open plan living area. So again, nice high ceilings here. As you can see, we've got ample furniture that you'd see in any large house. So two full-size three-seater sofas, couple of armchairs, large television, feature fireplace. So it's a really, really generous apartment, this. As we pan around, you'll see, again, full-size dining room table, but also open plan into the kitchen. We've got this lovely central fitted island. That's got a quartz or granite top so that's a really lovely breakfast room there again you've got the vaulted ceiling v-luxes really comprehensive kitchen this again that's just got the rear aspect so really nice and bright it's a lovely space so we're just out the rear of the development now and just show you this really lovely communal garden space so there's only four flats as i mentioned that have use of this so really lovely space very quiet very private all walled you've got bin storage in there i'll just give you a rear elevation of the building there we go it really is nice very well looked after very well maintained You've got plenty of seating out here. So imagine the residents enjoy sitting out and getting together. A few social occasions. It's rare that you'll see apartments with this fantastic outside space, all walled, all completely private. And just beyond this rear gate here, it just takes you to the parking for the properties. So that's it, that is for the Bell House. A really, really lovely apartment, fantastic size. Uh, just four of them right in central Pulbra. So great location, great lock up and leave. Uh, if you're looking to downsize, uh, absolutely perfect this property. So we hope you like what you see. But if you have any questions or want to know more, please don't hesitate to give us a call.